Kumar Sangakkara. The man in form, the man who's been holding Sri Lanka's batting together for quite a while. 350th game for the left-hander. And he's out there because of great piece of bowling from Chris Morris. I thought it was a little quicker too. He's bowling around the 130-132 mark. Then slipped one in. Good start. Down the wicket comes Sangakara. And hits the rope on the full. And that is a six. Excellent shot indeed. He did see that there was no man on the long on boundary, so he took his chance. And very well timed indeed. That experience really. He doesn't miss a trick, Sangakara. He knows that uh, Peterson doesn't make um, the ball turn too much. And uh, with so much space on the onside uh, behind the bowler. But that's an absolute beauty. Sangakara was just waiting for that. And... Well, that is going to be maximum. Good use of the feet. A good aggressive slot sweep that's gone over mid midwicket for six. Sangakara is in top form. Take a look at this. Kumar Sangakara was down the pitch and timed it so well. And he's now 50. Excellent innings. He's 78, one day 50. He's 25th in Sri Lanka. And he's 11th against South Africa, Kepler. He, he seems to like the South African goal. He certainly does. Unfortunately, from a, a South African point of view, that's very true. He's had a magnificent career in all forms of the game. He's a very good one day player. He's a good test player. Poor delivery to end. Really poor. That's just what AB de Villiers didn't want to see. through the gap and a run away for four it's the second ball of the over well it's gone straight over the man at square leg he hit it in the middle and flat as a tap and morris's head's gone down look at this they love it they're on their feet and they know sri lanka have got the bit between their teeth well, he picked that one up beautifully. Ball hitting the uh, meat of the bat. Although there's a man down in the deep, um, just had enough of it to carry it over. Fortunately, he middled it. Dead on line with that fielder. Great effort. <laughs> Got me again. And fine leg has got no chance. Fine legs up in the. Another glorious shot. And that's also cleared the boundary, I would reckon. That is a top cricket shot. As good as you'll see all season. Just watch carefully how he clears his leg and he doesn't force it, he just hits it with control. You're quite right, um, but I think this really is absolutely fantastic control batting. Sangakkara started quietly, and look at the acceleration now. Put away, one or two bounces. And that brings up a quite magnificent innings. The 100 comes up in just 103 balls, and it's his 16th one-day international. What a player, and what an innings we've seen today. Smiling faces in the stands, no doubt. Sangakkara, another century to his credit. Good use of the wrist. He's playing the field beautifully. In the gap. One bounce four. Six. Fifth six for Kumar Sangakara. He's in uh, absolutely magnificent form. 
In fact, I should say boundary hitting form, the 250 is up. And he's been uh, timing those shots, it's so fluent. And he's just picked his spots. He's just dominated the bowling so much. And this is another example of that. Much slower. This is not easy because he's hitting it behind square. Gets it over, just over. Clean him up. But it's been a, it's a no ball. And that's because it's not a front foot no ball though. I did see Richard Ketterborough looking around. And I do feel it's because he's cut the return crease with his back foot, is it? Yeah, that's that's the likeliest reason. But nothing seemed to be going right for South Africa. I wonder whether Sangakara was uh, lured into that shot because of a no ball. But Sri Lanka has good fortune. Sangakara survives. Very close. And he's got that wrong, unfortunately. Four. Very cleverly played. He's using that field and teasing the South Africans. 150 for Kumar Sangakkara. A monumental effort by the Sri Lankan number three. And uh, well, he's breaking records. He's gone up to 151 of 127, but today he's been at his best. He's every shot he played has come off, and he's played some delightful shots. Great improvisation. And uh, that last shot to get to the 150 was played so well by Sangakara. Got inside the line and uh, virtually helped it uh, down to fine leg. The fielder didn't pick it up. Yes, that shot seemed to signal uh, Sangakara's intention. Not that we didn't know it, but. Uh, Third is Sri Lanka looking to get close to that 320 now. This is in the air. Fielder in the deep. Gets underneath it and takes it. So finally the Sangakara onslaught ends. Oh, but he should be fully satisfied uh, with this great effort. What an absolutely brilliant, magnificent effort by Sangakara. I thought he miscued it. He was looking to go for another six and picking the tails from Domini on the boundary. Maybe he was thinking 340, but he's paced his innings really well. And that's what batsmen need to learn. Newer batsmen, younger batsmen need to learn. Great forward catch for Domini. What a knock, his highest score, 169 off 137. 303 for five.